hello guys welcome to my channel thank you for supporting my channel now i have 130 subscribers Hooray! i'm so happy thank you very much for your support so today we're going to look at how we can add color to our perfume many of you you've been trying out how to make perfume and i also have already dropped a video on how you can make your own perfume but sometimes people will like oh maybe you go to store and you see some perfume especially designer perfume that is not white in color you no know, it has different shade of color so today we are going to look at how you can add color to your own perfume so before you add color to your perfume the number one thing is you need to mix that color with your uh, methanol so i'm going to do that now so i'm having the first thing is to add your color to methanol that is to have it in liquid so if you don't mind me if you want to use it make sure you use your glove so that you not have the stain so you have your color to the bottle and add this is my channel that I'm using and add it then shake it so this methanol and the color together you can see it now because I'm, I want to use three colors today that is I'm going to mix different colors I have blue here this one I already mix it and I have this one also so let's try mm -mm -mm. let me try this color this second color we also take the same process like the first color I did same process you add the color to methanol to get the solution and whatever we get from it then we now add it to our perfume same method same process see when you are adding your color uh, you can use a pipette or a dropper but i advise you use a disposable dropper and if you don't have that it's something very easy so i'm going to have my perfume let me use this one this is also a perfume i'm done i'm going to have this perfume this is perfume now now depending on how thick you want it to be I'm going to use this one, just a drop because I don't want it to be too, uh, because if it's too much, it's going to stain your dress. Remember, it's not only color dress. Okay. Ah, yeah. Good. See? I'm having a color of this. I'll try another color. Yes. Oh my now see is this so for you to see. Mm. I'll use this. Just going to be just a little drop of it. You can see. But what I do is, uh, if I'm making my different perfume, I don't use color to change maybe the outlook or whatever. Like for instance, I have five fragrances here, so I have a different color. And when you are adding color to your perfume, you need to take note of the amount of color so that 
if you have a customer that needs that particular time type and you want it to be the same thing without having any changes you need to write it down that is your recipe and when you write it down you'll be able to produce many more batches of that same thing so i have this now this one now oh my goodness I'm happy because this is my best so far. This that plan. But I have five fragrances there. You can see. Mm. Can you smell it? Such nice one. This one. Very nice. So I'm not going to use color to spoil it. Though I love the color, but for the purpose of this uh, class. You're already in the class, you know, perfume making class. That is how I'm making this. you need uh, to have your So now today you've learned how you can uh, mix your color before you add it to your perfume and how you can actually add the color to your perfume. Till I come your way next time. My name is Fumi Oyelaki. Please don't forget to subscribe and give it thumbs up and I will see you in my next video where I'll be sharing various tools that you will need if you are going into perfume making. Thank you once again. Keep blending, keep mixing, and I'll see you next time. Bye!